Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at the Ghostbusters Hasbro Plasma Series figures. Now, this is going to be an eight video series. Um, for this video, we're going to look at them all as a whole, in box and everything. Uh, we're then going to take them out of the boxes and stand them next to each other, and then in each sub. Uh, individual uh, video we're going to take a look at each figure separately and we're going to build the terror dog so while my wife was at walmart she saw that they actually had the complete set of the plasma series figures and she called me and asked if i wanted them i said sure get me peter and dana you know well when she got home she surprised me with the complete series which I thought was awesome. They are sold at Walmart for $20 a piece. Uh, the whole collection is about $120 plus tax. As you can see, we have right here, Dana Barrett in her box. Ghostbusters logo on the side. Uh, the, uh, the symbol for the Ghostbusters. Uh, her name patch, Barrett Plasma Series for ages four and up. Got the Hasbro logo. On the side here, you got some Art Deco style Ghostbusters images. On the other side, uh, you've got some, uh, it looks like maybe some blueprints of the Proton Pack and whatnot. And then on the back, you have <clears throat> Dana Barrett. There is no Dana, only Zool. And the rest is in different languages. You got Spanish, probably Portuguese, and um, whatnot. But as you can see here, you got Finn's Clortho, the Build a Ghost. You got Peter, you got Ray, you got Egon, you got Winston, you got Dana, and you got Gozer. Now we'll move her out of the way. And the same, the box is the same for each of the characters. Um, <clears throat> and as you can see, she comes with the. It looks like. She comes with the torso of the terror dog right there. And that's pretty much it, all that she comes with. Now with Gozer, she comes with the head of the terror dog along with some energy bolts. And as you can see, everything else remains the same. All the boxes are the same aside from the name tag at the bottom. And as you can see there, there we go. As you can see there, all four Ghostbusters. We have Peter, we have Egon, we have Ray, and we have Winston. Uh, again, the boxes are all the same, uh, except for the name tags on the bottom and the way they're portrayed on the back. Uh, that's something I did not go over with Gozer. Uh, Gozer, the Destructor and Traveler. Gozer is the ancient evil with a lot of aliases <laughs> and as you can see she comes with the head of Vince Clortho for Vankman everything on the box is the same except that and he comes with the left leg of Vince Clortho the man with the mouth Peter can convince almost anybody of almost anything And as you can see, they also come with other accessories, like uh, Finkman comes with Ghost Trap, along with his Proton Pack and Wand. Uh, Egon comes with the PKE Meter, along with his Proton Pack and Wand. And on the back, he comes with the right leg of Vince Clortho. Uh, when... Um, Ray, the heart of the team, Ray's ready and more than willing to bust some ghosts. He comes with the rear left leg of Vince Clortho. It looks like. And he comes with his ecto goggles along with the proton pack and wand. And then Winston Zedmore, he comes with the right rear leg of Vince Clortho, 
along with a proton stream it looks like along as well as this proton pack and wand the voice of reason winston's the one you want in your corner when times get tough and as you can see this box was a little bit smashed but that's okay they only uh, according to my wife they only had one winston and i think one gozer i want to say um but that's okay i'm not keeping them in the boxes they're going on display as soon as i get them out so let's go ahead and pause this now that we've taken a look at all the boxes and something you should notice on these the only two that do not have the warnings on the side small parts are dana and winston as you can see down there at the bottom these four all have small pieces with the attention signs dana and winston do not so as i said let's go ahead and pause this we'll open the boxes and take a look at the figures together all right guys and we're back took a little bit longer to unpackage these things than i thought uh, and they look great i can't wait to build the vince clortho figure uh now gozer they aren't just energy blasts that she comes with they're actually an extra set of hands with the energy blasts sculpted into them now there are a few things that i'm going to be going over in each individual figure review so make sure you stay tuned for that being that i only upload videos on tuesdays and thursdays or at least make them public anyway as they're pre-uploaded and waiting to premiere these will be published this one is coming out on tuesday so the next one look for i guess we will start in order so look for peter vankman on thurs this thursday and then next tuesday you can look for ray stance next thursday is egon spangler the following tuesday will be winston zettimore the following thursday will be dana barrett and after that that following tuesday will be gozer and then the final thursday will be vince clortho so make sure you tune in for those like i said i do only publish videos on tuesdays and thursdays otherwise i would be more than happy to go ahead and review each of these all this week but i'd rather just fill up two days a week with videos that way you guys are always getting videos at least twice a week the only times i will upload more often uh, will be one that just cannot wait so <clears throat> let's take a look real quick these figures dana stands about six inches tall uh gozer comes in just under six inches uh same with the others uh gozer is just a little bit shorter than the uh, the other ghostbusters um but yeah these guys look great uh, i can't wait to uh, review each individual figure and then display them in my ghostbusters display case so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video i've been shannon this has been come again tv the only place on youtube where all geek culture collides make sure you tune in for the remainder of the review videos take care geeks if you enjoyed that video make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you stay up to date on all things geek culture also go ahead and check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched i'm shannon for come again tv the only place on youtube where all geek culture collides Take care, geeks.